Yeah, you every time up. I come out, you're because like... Because we're always surprised. Because you're growing because up you before our eyes. Because you are just more and more beautiful every time oh, you come thank out. thank you. Yeah, yes. just when we think you can't outdo yourself, you do it. That's sweet. Thank Turning you. 19 next month. Boy, there it goes. Oh, my God. <laughs> Been doing goes. this since she was seven years old. What was the first show you did? In? I did Barney. Oh, you did Barney, Yes, huh? I did Barney. Mm -hmm. That's right. There you are. Dear. Oh, gosh. Really? You still have that hat? <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> no. Did you like uh, acting as a kid? Was it, I mean, I would think that would be the most fun job ever to be in make-believe all the time. It was. I was, especially on Barney. I mean, we dressed up. I got to be Alice and Alice in Wonderland one week, and then yeah. the next week I got to be baking things. Like, it was really fun. Sure. It was definitely Absolutely. Fun. And what also was fun was Wizards of Waverly Place. That was a big hit, wasn't it? Yeah. And I think you finally wrapped up your fourth and final year, is it? I did, yeah. We finished the show about a month ago. Has it been seen? Has the finale been seen yet? No, no. It hasn't aired yet. Is it a big uh, extravaganza? It is. I think, I think our fans will be surprised. I I was definitely surprised on how it ended. Good, good. But what are we going to do now? Yeah. <laughs> what now are we going to watch now? What Barney's are we parents gone? going to do? Monte Carlo. Oh, oh that's true. Oh, Monte Carlo. I'll, I'm going to make movies for everybody. So. Terrific. Where do, where do you find time with all the schedule you got, you know, with... Uh, recording. Uh, recording, movies and everything. What about the poor Beeb out there, you know, waiting for you to... <laughs> waiting to for me. <laughs> <laughs> you and Justin are, are an item in the papers. Are we? Yeah, I think. Well, I see pictures of you together everywhere. Oh, yeah. There you go. Isn't he cute, that beep? <laughs> he, he, he is a doll, that Isn't kid. He, he really is a great guy. Yeah, he's great. What a, what a sweetheart. I would think it would be very hard to be young and in the public eye and in the entertainment industry. It would be so difficult to have, like, a, 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 a private life. It is a little bit at times. But. How do you handle those paparazzis? <laughs> when you're just when you're just now with the bee, you know, you're trying to walk down a street and those papas are yelling, clicking away at you? It's not as bad as people think. Oh, good. Like I, I they I don't respect what they do, I get it, but I don't I don't really like it. But I kinda I can avoid it. I don't mm -hmm. have it all the time. Good. Good for you. So what's going on next month? You're kicking off your national tour? Yes, right Headlining now. Headlining on your own? I know. I'm Good for you. Oh my gosh, yeah. that's a big deal. I know. I have, uh, my album came out today, and Monte Carlo comes out on Friday, this Friday, and then I go on tour July 28th. And I'm really excited because it's the first time that I have, like, creative control, so I'm going to have, like, costume changes on stage and dancers, and it's going to be really fun. Do you oh. get nervous? Do you ever, uh, or is, are you one of those people that sort of thrives when the spotlight goes on? and the crowd starts screaming. No, because I don't, I feel so safe with my fans. Like, mm -hmm. that's when I feel, the, like, the most safe is when mm -hmm. I'm on stage at my concerts with my fans because they're, they, if I mess up, if I do something wrong, they're with me and it's I like laugh. you're with friends, Yeah, they're it? like yeah. my friends, so uh, that's fine. Boy, you got a lot going on in your career. Did you hear that I'm in the Hall of Fame here? <laughs> really? Yes. Yay! It's a hall right in the back hall. Thank you, Selena, for giving me a little applause. We're going to take a break, but we have some, we have some um, Twitter questions. Okay. So will you answer them when we return? Yes, of course. Okay, great. Right back Super. in a moment with Selena Gomez. Right now, we have some Twitter questions. Yes, Twitter, Twitter questions. This is from Little, Little Queen 98. Little Queen 98. Do you, I love this question. Do you ever wish you could be a normal 18 year old? Um, I think I'm pretty normal. I mean, I get to do what I love and I get to do amazing things, but I, I feel pretty normal. I, I go, I go through everything they sure. go through. Yeah. Um, K96 girl what said, she want? what is the strangest thing a fan has ever done for you? Uh, I had a woman tattoo my face on her thigh. <laughs> oh, I had that done all the time. <laughs> Especially now that I'm in the Hall of Fame. <laughs> Where she put it right there yep, on her thigh? Right she came and she showed you? Yep. How did she look? Did it I look think, like I you? Think it did it look like me. With it. <laughs> <laughs> what else? Uh, let's see. Um, Shut Up Meredith says, will you ever do a duet with Justin Bieber? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I guess maybe if it happens, but not mm. anytime soon. You don't, like, seek it out? No. Yeah. 
All right, let's talk about the new movie, Monte Carlo. Tell me about it. You play two different characters, I, I, I told you. I do. It's really fun. Mm. I'm excited because it's kind of like my first step into like film, so I worked really hard on it. I do get to play two characters. One is Grace, and she's a girl from Texas, and then the other character is Cordelia, and she's a British heiress, and oh. she is completely evil and very fun for me to play. <laughs> so it's like a movie with a mistaken identity kind of thing. And you filmed it over there in, in Europe? I did. I filmed most of the film in Hungary, and then we shot in Paris, and then we shot in Monte Carlo. And oh, they call nice. it Monte Carlo because it t most of the time it's in there, in that area, Monte yes. Carlo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, beautiful place. Yes, it was gorgeous. Wow. So it's very funny, you know, when you were in Paris, the Gelmans were in Paris, and I think that uh, young Jamie Gelman, uh, who was one of your biggest fans, got a glimpse of you walking oh, through really? the hotel, and it was yeah. very exciting. Oh, oh, we heard all about it. That's so very, sweet. We were very excited about well, it. Well, in the movie, you do a British accent, and you're forever lapsing into your British accent. I I'd love to hear just a little conversation between the two of you speaking in British. Oh, Lord. No, really, why don't we just talk? <laughs> what, 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 what kind of British heiress are you? I'm, I'm proper, so my, my voice goes lower. Oh, well, I'm from the wrong side of the chat. Exactly. <laughs> well, why don't so, you do well, me? Let, we, let, we don't really get along. All I can say is that me wellies are all <laughs> rocking. <laughs> Liam Neeson. <laughs> uh, okay. Now, we have a scene here from Monte Carlo. In this scene, Andy McDowell, who plays your mom, right, in this movie, is talking about uh, her trip of a lifetime to Paris. Here we go. Monte Carlo. Oh, heavy duty. Good afternoon. Oh, heavy. <laughs> so that movie opens on Friday, and later in our show this morning, Selena will be performing one of her songs for us, okay? Yes. Selena, thanks very much.